Look, gee, Elmo, that was my last one. Oh, that's okay, Gabby. Elmo will just take this one. No, 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 wait, wait, Elmo. What? Rocco says that he wants the oatmeal raisin cookie. Rocco? Rocco's a rock, Zoe. Rocco won't know the difference. Yes, he will. <laughs> you can't have that cookie, Elmo. Rocco wants to eat it. How? How is Rocco going to eat that cookie, Zoe? Tell Elmo. Rocco doesn't even have Favorite it. Favorite rock. Have you ever had a conversation with someone where you just don't understand where the logic is coming from? Like no matter how hard you try to carry the ones and twos, their math just ain't quite mathin'. Rocko, our favorite rock. What's good everyone? Whether you're somehow new to rolled ice cream or a longtime fan, you're gonna be locked in with this video. I can guarantee it. We're going to be looking at the most popular combos out there. Of course, some other dope creators making some cool design. But of course, being this channel, we're also gonna be looking at some quite cringy rolled ice cream videos as well. So it's gonna be a really healthy balance of all the creative stuff, but then some garbage as well, as this channel is known for. I mean, there's some cringy, cringy bases out there. There's some with pickle juice, there's some with hot takis, and because I had to suffer looking through them, you're gonna suffer looking at them as well. If you look at the tag rolled ice cream on TikTok, there's 829 point how many million views? Just look at how many videos there are. And some channels are just dedicated to doing rolled ice cream. That's just how popular this thing has gotten. It's its own craze within ice cream. It's pretty cool. But I think the most popular combo by far is my personal favorite which is a cookies and cream classic. And keep in mind the rolled ice cream crave exploded here in the States like in 2017, 2018. There's tons of variety. There's almost no repetition. There's so many creative things that people are doing with this. So the first clip I got here is by Danny Rizuki. He's like a really big rolled ice cream creator on TikTok. I wanted to bring this clip in because it's showing a beginner making rolled ice cream from scratch. So I thought it'd be really cool to see the process from like the beginning. It's pretty wild that like no matter what your base is, you're just chopping that thing up. So it could be like nuts or it can be like a liquid, whatever your base is, you're just smacking that thing together, regardless of what it is. And it's like, it's wild to see the difference between a beginner or somebody who doesn't really know what they're doing to like these pros that just slap it all together and it looks so easy that anybody could just pick it up and run with it, which is really hardly ever the case. <laughs> that slap. I think the hardest process has to be the rolling part. But then look at she just glides through it. So I, I might be wrong. Maybe it's a slapping. Maybe when you're just. That's the hardest part. If you also want to explore his page, you'll find some really creative ideas like this video with him making some rolled ice cream with pickle slush, pickle juice. Looks like pee in the snow, some sleep maybe. I don't really know what this. I can't watch, I can't watch that anymore. I found this Burger King rolled ice cream video that you're just gonna have to watch. hot takis I was telling you about. Oh, I promised you hot taki. Here it goes. Look, I'm spreading that around. Looks like something you, you put on a rash or something. That looks like the inside of a unprocessed hot dog. <laughs> it's just so unsettling to know that those are takis in there. They're, oh, no. That's that, if you eat that, you have to preheat your toilet. That's what you gotta do. In this one, we got this creator, Double X Ice. He <laughs> makes rolled ice cream blindfolded. We watched a person struggle through her first time making it. Now we're gonna watch somebody make it blindfolded. So you see the difference I'm saying between the skill gap of like anyone thinking they could pick this up or it seems easy enough. And then these people that can do it blindfolded. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
Now, a really cool idea I saw was from Joe Worth on TikTok. We got something special for you guys today. We're gonna show you how we make one of our cones before the ice cream. So we're making a chocolate and vanilla half and half cone. We're gonna cook it for just a little bit. Then we're gonna stick it in our roller and roll it on up. Then we're gonna put it under our heat lamp and let it form just for a few more minutes. Today we are making our peanut butter brownie ice cream. This is our best selling flavor. We took brownies, peanut butter drizzle. We're mixing that with some ice cream. Then at the end, we're gonna add another peanut butter drizzle for all you peanut butter lovers out there. This is crazy good. So for our cones, we actually only roll half the ice cream and then stick the other half as a soft serve. So here we're spreading it out. We're gonna roll it on up and then we can't forget about the little pretty baby one, even though this one's a little big. Then we're gonna put our ice cream in the cone, add a brownie, a little more peanut butter drizzle, and that's our peanut butter brownie and a half and a half cone. The ability to put your own spin, your own creativity, your own kind of trend on something, you're able to change it however it fits your style. Another really cool creator in the TikTok world ice cream space I came across was Ice Cream World's World say that 10 times fast. They have a lot of variety, colorful page, all their thumbnails and all their kind of, well, I don't know if they're called thumbnails on TikTok, but whatever they are, they're super bright. They have so many different varieties and this video specifically caught me. <laughs> I don't know what that is. This video specifically with the watermelon, just pouring it out and then slapping that up in the rolled ice cream. That was really impressive to me. So I definitely stopped on this one. It looks like peppermint bark or just something. Oh, that, that looks so good. I'm telling you, sign me up, sign me up. I want some of that. Well, I had a really good time. Hopefully you did too, which means you're gonna like that video, comment your favorite, share it with somebody else who you know is a rolled ice cream fan or just loves ice cream. Eat more rolled ice cream in 2022.